including this little tourista here. So, still in Barcelona, but we're in uh, one of the most important uh, venues of my, particularly my younger life anyway. We're at the Bernard Pipinel uh, Piscina swimming pool in Barcelona. We're in lane four, over here. Uh, in 1992, I managed to pull off a world record, 50 meter breaststroke, gold medal, uh, two silvers, two bronze, which was a fantastic, fantastic achievement. Do you know what's really interesting though? Um, when I got involved in disability rights, I didn't really ever talk about my swimming because I felt that sort of within the disability rights movement, everyone thought those of us that were into sport were kind of like doing it for triumphing over tragedy reasons, but it was never that. I was just horribly competitive as a very young person. Elements of me still are, but swimming was an outlet for that. And yes, I know disability sports and segregationists, they absolutely are. But at the time, there was no other avenue for my kind of like my sporting competitiveness. And I think now that I'm a bit older, that I realise actually I was fantastically proud of what I achieved. I pulled it off with no lottery training, no lottery uh, funding. I was working full time like everybody else. And this isn't a triumph over tragedy story. It's more about bloody mindedness than anything else and an out of control competitive streak. And so here we are. 26 years later oh my god that makes me feel very old but oh it's just so fantastic to be here and the swimming pool looks as gorgeous as it did in 1992 looks a bit rough around the edges as you can see but here we are and it's fantastic to be here